we're gonna go look at an open house today. We actually submitted an application. We just have to cross our fingers so it works out. It is a very, very exciting weekend. We just got to Napa for my sister's wedding. I cannot believe I'm saying that. It's been like two plus years in the making. So this is a momentous occasion. Checked into our hotel, the same hotel that I stayed at with James for our four year anniversary. Oh my gosh, I see them. I see Marissa, my sister. Just like walking down this little path that I can see from my window, but um, we're about to go grab some dinner, explore the grounds a bit, and just kind of convene with the entire group who's here. Both sides of the family are here. Rehearsal is tomorrow, wedding is the day after, and it's gonna be a really fun weekend. I cried all of the ceremony, and my sister didn't even cry. <laughs>
We are on our way to do something very, very exciting. So our lease for this unit is up at the end of August and we're deciding if we want to move. We have about a month left until we have to either renew or put in our notice. And so we're gonna go look at an open house today for an apartment that I absolutely love. Definitely wanna go see the next apartment we met in person. This one, we totally did the process online and it was fantastic but it is just a little bit small. So kind of hoping to get a larger space for next year. I'm someone who loves like going to open houses and just kind of visiting homes and spaces. And so I'm really excited for our first showing of this season. Walking through Central Park because this place is on the Upper East Side and look how nice it is today. We have three days until the official start of summer. So I'm definitely feeling that through New York. So happy. to say something I come up with nothing maybe we can talk until we figure out a topic been so long in my head so just got back from touring this upper west side apartment um and I don't actually think we're going to end up submitting an application just because it's close enough to our like current apartment where it wouldn't feel like too much of a difference in terms of the things around us. It is bigger than this current space, but it would be more expensive. And so kind of trade-off wise, I'm getting a little bit less out of it. We actually submitted an application for the Upper East Side apartment. And ideally we do want to be on the Upper East Side to be closer to friends and family. James has some extended family over on the East Side as well as some of his best friends from college. And so that'd be like a great move for us location um, we'll just have to cross our fingers so it works out, but otherwise we are we are here for another year. Headed out to dinner right now. got back from getting my nails done. I absolutely love this color. I asked for like a milky white and the reason that I am getting my nails done is because we are actually leaving for Italy tomorrow, which I am so, 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 so excited for. We are going to the Amalfi Coast and then Florence and Rome. I've only been to Italy for literally less than one day before. When I was 14 years old as part of a choir tour, we stopped in Venice for like half a day to perform and that was it and so I've never actually even spent a night in Italy. It's gonna be a really really fun time exploring a lot of new places. Today is a busy 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 day. We've got a lot to do but I cannot wait for tomorrow. I'm definitely feeling a lot of excitement for this trip which I of course will be vlogging. Something that came in the mail that I was very excited to receive before leaving is this huge box full of K-beauty goodies from Blooming Coco. Blooming Coco is a website that specializes in sourcing authentic K-beauty products and distributing them in America. This was actually my first time ordering from the website and I was so impressed by both the selection of just like good brands they had available and the shipping time. Blooming Coco literally got this stuff to my door in less than a week after ordering in no particular order. This Vita C moisturizer with dark spot care. So I actually have like hyperpigmentation on my face from some bad breakouts last year and so I'm hoping that this does the trick. It had really good reviews. Green tangerine flavor as well. 
This is what it looks like. Got a powder. This is the oil capture cooling powder from Peripera. And I have like a really oily face, especially in the summer around my T-zone area. So I never have too much powder. Oh, I'm really excited for this one. This is a palette I've been wanting to try. This is a Romand eyeshadow palette in Mahogany Garden. And like, I'm just obsessed with these colors. There's a good mix of browns and warm and cool tones and glitters, which I love. So definitely bringing this with me to Italy. Also got a contour palette from the same brand. This kind of shade is what I like to use for like nose contour. And then this side, I don't know what I'll do with yet, but got two different types of lippies. I usually go for like kind of more berry shades is what I just tend to find looks best on me, but they both look really pretty and I am very excited to try. I also got a Beauty of Joseon eye cream that is again perfect for traveling. It's like in a flat tube. And then last but definitely not least, we have this Moonshot cushion foundation. I actually first tried this a couple years back and I absolutely love it. It is my go-to. This is the Moonshot Micro Setting Fit Cushion. Oh my I am so excited to try all of these products. And so thank you so much Blooming Coco for sending them to me. I will leave the link to shop their website in the description box below. And yeah, if you're ever looking for some K-beauty products in a pinch, I highly recommend. We are so hangry right now. Haven't eaten since like 10 a.m. And we went out of breakfast. So we only had like cheesy pudding. We usually have eggs and toast. Anyway, so we are, I am so hungry. I am so ready to eat. This is truly so random, but I am in the middle of packing for Italy and I had to show you guys this new favorite find. This cutie little pill box is actually one of the gifts that my sister gave me for being a bridesmaid. And I think it's an Amazon find, so I'm gonna grab the link from her and throw it in the description box. But this is just like exactly, I didn't know I needed this, but now that I have it, it's making my life so much better. And so I wanted to share it with you guys. Okay, so to give you guys a little pill box run through, I have my multivitamins here, my vitamin C here. This is like, some sort of Pepsid comp. I don't think it is Pepsid, but it basically has the same effect. So James gets Asian glow, so I'm gonna bring some for him for when we're drinking all the spritzes. Eight sleep gummies to help us get through the jet lag. Uh, you're supposed to take two per person, so this is for me and James. And just some Tylenol and allergy meds because I'm not usually allergic, but for some reason in New York this spring and summer, I've been like full of allergies. And so just in case, I'm gonna bring some to Italy as well. We have these little lids that just pop on top. And the lastly, there's this little pick for like prying open these compartments. And we are all packed. 